of a simply supported beam by using ANSI software. So we are going to take the stress analysis for the simply supported beam. Okay, by using the ANSI software. Okay, here preferences structural H method. Okay, then preprocessor element type. Then add it, delete. Add. We are going to add the element beam element two not one eighty eight. Then okay. Then close. Then real constant, add and delete, add B188. Okay. Then material properties, material models, structural, linear, elastic, isotropic. So things models are is 2E45 and poisons ratio is 0 0.3. Okay. Now sections, beam, common sections, breadth is 100 and height is 100. Then give okay. Now Modeling creates key points in FCS. For the first key point, we are going to give the value as zero. For the second key point, we are going to give the value as three thousand. Distance of the first key point and the second key point is three thousand, and the second key point and third key point is thousand. So we are going to give the value as four thousand from the distance from the first key point and the third key point. Now, first key point and the fourth key point distance is six thousand give okay now the four points are created now we are going to take the values and we, we need to join these points by using lines straight line first key point to the second key point second key point to the third key point third key point to the fourth key point give okay now we are going to mess this element so mess and uh, mesh tool mod size mesh pick the first element second element and third element give okay now the element is missed now we need to find out the difference of the three four nodes so again we are going to give the plot and the lines we can get the previous one okay now we are going to give the loads uniformly distributed load and the point load so loads define load apply structural displacement so in the left side and <clears throat> all the points are fixed so on key points so q ok all degrees of freedom is fixed displacement is zero so here we are going to give the displacement value is zero so give ok now the displacement is fixed now again we are going to give the on key points on the opposite side end give ok and the ui displacement value is zero then give ok so y direction will be fixed now we are going to give the pressure on beams pick the box then from the first node to second node okay now the i node value is 20 j node value is 20 so give ok now udl load is applied now we are going to give the point load force per moment on nodes. Pick the third node and give OK. The y value, the y direction minus 100, give OK. Now the load is applied as 100 meter. Now we are going to make the solution solve current L. Give OK. Now the solution is done, so the procedure is correct. Now we 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 are going to find out the output value and the general post processor plot results counter plot nodal solution displacement vector sum to find out the real view plot controls style size and shape on then okay now we, we get the isometric view sorry oblique view and isometric view is this is isometric view now the highest displacement will be moved according to the y direction or x direction the vector sum is 288.982 now we are going to find out the stress value stress 1 minus stress give ok the highest stress created is 394.647 is the highest stress cre created so how this load Acting and the stress created by plot controls animate 
and deform shape deform plus on deform give okay as is the movement of stress created in the point with the help of udl and the point local So thank you for your kind cooperation to see this video. Thank you.